G'day everyone, thank you for tuning in, case swapping time, and uh, as I've been saying for the past few days, um, my main PC, which is this one in this prion case, the airflow's just not there for it, she's getting hot. This is the Core i7 that I picked up from my friend's computer business yesterday, and what we're going to do is, we're going to take everything out of this box, put it in another box, and everything out of this box will actually go into this box, so that I've got better airflow, I can add more fans, and hopefully keep it cooler. So let's uh, let's start the strip out. All right. So I've got both cases stripped out now. This case was not easy to get anything out of. Um, trying to get the optical drive out and the motherboard out was a total pain. But I've done that. So that's now ready to, ready to have another board put in it. This is the one that's going to take the main PC. And I've also noticed in here I've got another fan right there plus a spot for a fan up here so i'm going to be swapping going to be putting some fans in it to try and keep it cool and then uh, we'll see how thing go how things go from there but nevertheless let's get the main pc board back in and then we'll uh, work on this also i've got to take this adapter off here and put it onto here as well anyway all right let's get the main pc put back together okay so there's the main PC board back in and I've got to tell you this is the first time I've ever had a computer case that has actual half decent cable management because if you've had a look at most of my other computers all the cables have just been all there but this one's actually got cable management all right so now what I've got to do is try and work out how to mount all my hard drives because I've only got one of these let me have a look here you see I've only got one of these clips so I'm gonna to have to work out how I can uh, mount the hard drives as safely as possible. Pity I haven't got a whole pile of three and a half inch drives. That'd be handy, wouldn't it? Sorry, two and a half inch drives. That'd be handy, wouldn't it? All right, I've got the Blu-ray in, the board's in. Everything's plugged up under there, as you can see. So now all I've got to do is work out how to mount all the rest of my hard drives. Let's see how I go with that. All right, well, we're all in. I've got to get some more spud trays for the hard drives, but they'll be all right, like sitting like that, because it's obviously not going to move. But we're all plugged up, we're all in. Not the uh, not the easiest thing to get the side on the other side, obviously with all the cabling that I've got there, but we're all in, we're all done. And now, I guess what we do is put the other side back on and bring her up. All right, got the other side on. I haven't put any fans in it yet. But uh, I've got the other side on now, which is good. Have a look at the front really nice case there's a fan just there oh i've got a loose screw in there somewhere but that's all right all right so i think what we'll do now if i can just get this back where it should be oh i think what we'll do now is uh plug it all back up and let's see if it comes back alive all right well she fits in the hole much nicer to get to let's uh let's make sure i've got this plugged up properly shall we Nice bright blue light. Light in the fan there. Let's see what happens up here. Screen's turned on. And we're good to go. Oh, beauty. Bright blue light. Light at the front there. We've got a fan in the front there, which is good. That's obviously going to help keep things cool. Oh... That's not so good. All right, let's see if I can work out what happened. All right, let's see what happens this time. Ah, oh, there we go. I don't have a hard drive lead running though. That's that's a problem. Maybe I've got the hard drive lead round the wrong way. Hmm. I'm going to come up. Sure, I've put the drive in properly. All right, I've got a problem. I'll, uh, I'll oh no, here it comes. There it goes. All right, let's, uh, let's go see what's up with these drives. All right, well, we've got a bit of a problem here. Spare stuff's not showing up. 
the three terabyte is. I've obviously got a problem somewhere, but at least it's up and running now, so I guess that's a good thing. Um, no hard drive lead, so I've also got the hard drive lead around the wrong way. I'm going to have to try and fix that. But apart from that, she's uh, she's reasonably happy, which is nice. But there we go. Nice new case for backyard IT. Blue lights there for the fan, which is good. That's going to help keep um, keep the system cooler as well, which is nice. All right, uh, I'll go and sort out these problems and see what I've done wrong. All right, so I've fixed up the front panel connection, so we've now got a hard drive LED. We've got our power LED. We've got our USBs connected. Our audio's done. Our USB 2's done. Uh, DVD's done. So now we've just got to make sure I've got that other drive show up. So uh, we'll, uh, we'll just have a look here quickly. And hope that it is actually showing up this time. And... It is. So there it is there. It's not showing up as spare stuff, which is a bit of a worry. It's showing it up as that one, which it's not supposed to be. Uh, okay. I'll have to work out what's going on there. But I've now got one, two, three, four local hard drives. A, obviously our big four terabyte drive. All my network drives. So we're good to go. It's a nice looking case, isn't it? Nice big fan down there, which is nice. That's going to help keep it cool, especially under uh, under load. But there we go. New case for Backyard IT's main computer. Thank you very much for watching. Please like, comment and subscribe. Cheers.